Hello everybody, my name is WhatTheFu and welcome back to another brand new episode of what the Fool Gaming. If you're brand new here, we're bringing you content to help raise awareness to charity. Um, but today we're not playing the game. We are d and ding with, uh, with my friend Zeke of the Cosmic Reject, Dex, and Kota. Hello. Maru, I, I honestly can never say your name correctly because Sebastian says one shit, you say another piece of shit, and then like I'm trying to get this pile of shit together. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. What do you prefer? My. Uh. Who? Ah. Uh, I don't have a preference. You don't have a preference? Nope. I have that three separate. I have three words in this username, so it's just. <laughs> Matsu. Uh, like, what did what did Sebastian call you? I forgot during college. All right. I, I think I don't think I think he was calling. I think he called me by my real name. I don't think I talked about my uh username back then okay i mean okay cool so uh zeke you're the head of the show what what are you doing today all right everybody um thank you for um hosting us um my name is uh of course he, he introduced me but once again i am zeke fowler i run the cosmic rejects youtube channel uh, one of the uh, shows we do on the youtube channel is a podcast called bell hill saga it uses um henshin the um Sentai RPG. It's a uh, brand new RPG thought up by Cave of Monster Games as um, the basis of its storytelling. And um, funny, and um, normally we would be on um, session number five, but uh, due to um, little bits of trouble with uh, cloud storage, that doesn't exist anymore. So you guys get to see us record, re record the fourth session. Live. Whoa! Hopefully this works out pretty well because um, if if both of our uh, media sources fork, then we're screwed. Yeah. Yeah. So like, wait. What? Very, very so, very much so. But that's all right. I got um OBS running. We should be good. <laughs> yeah, I got my OBS running. You got your OBS running. Hopefully, both ends don't crash. But if they do both crash, then we are doing it live. Crashed. <laughs> yeah, I just started up again. Hope, um, like, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, uh, uh, the way the show works is, um, I don't know if you got, like, um, if anybody in the chat has ever seen Power Rangers or Super Sentai, it's, it's that, but D and D. However, um, instead of, um, the normal dice roll mechanics, the, uh, the game has, um, a turn-based system in which, um, you have heavy turns which are more concrete actions, and depending on which color you have will affect um, what those turns would end up looking like. Uh, there are soft turns, which are kind of like um, plays against type or intentional club-ups, and um, those will um, award you uh, points, and um, points are how you make um, hard turns. You get five per character, and the way these guys have been playing, um, each one's going to start the game with one point, and... Um, yeah, and um, uh, bah, beyond all that, yeah, it's no dice roll. It's um, more imagination based than um, a normal D and D game is, where they have like um, a, where they have like a here is um, og here is gray ogre. Gray ogres have um, roll defense for blah blah blah. No, there's none of that in Henshin. It's um, here is monster. Figure it out. Okay, you've made a normal action. That means you're open to whatever interpretation I want. So, oh, God. so if you're the narrator, you can end up being really um, nice or really harsh to your players. But for the players themselves, it like allows them to like I don't know think their way out of their um, obstacles a lot easier. I for one appreciate the simplicity. Yeah, yeah. it's pretty nice. It's e it's uh, user friendly. Yeah, it's very uh, yeah very new user friendly and very fun. Uh, we are using the Monster Freak module. That's a uh, that's one of the um, expansions in the game. There are five. I think there are currently um, seven at the moment. Uh, I liked uh, Monster Freaks because uh, when we were starting this game out, uh, it was October and Halloween was around the corner, and it just kind of felt right to just uh, yeah, you know what? Yeah, Hollywood monsters. Right. Yeah. Sorry, my mouse fell. Um, <laughs> How dare you let your pet fall? Uh, no. Poor Mousy. I need him to click things. Oh, no. Um, you gotta pet him real good. So, um, uh, yeah, so, uh, 
the um, current cast is uh, Tyler. He plays uh, Ty, the Red Ranger. Uh, Coda, he plays Maru, the uh, Pink Ranger. And we have uh, De uh, Dex, he plays the Blue Ranger J. I've noticed he actually changed it. J mixed up because both of their names end in a Y. <laughs> so if that happens during the recording, so that happens at any time, chat, you make sure to make fun of me mercilessly. Wait, hold on. Uh, Zeke, I don't think you realize that Ty is T-A-I, not T-Y. Really? Yes. Okay, no, but whatever. I'm, okay, no, I've been listening. I've been writing it as, um, uh, like, uh, I'm writing it as T-Y. <laughs> You're good. So You're good. So it's T-A-I? T-A-I, yes. Okay, cool. I'll remember that from now on. Um, I'll totally rework that. Yeah, I anglicized it. You anglicize <laughs> no, I mean, hey, hey, you, as the narrator, you don't read the, the lines between our words, so you're completely fine. <laughs> Alright, so, um, yeah, um, if you guys want to, no, I see a, um, we were refreshing on the, uh, Discord stream here. Uh, oh, cool, Mar, oh, thanks, uh, thanks there, uh, Coda. um, Coda here has um, the point system set up. Normally, I use um, little half beads to do this. But like, yeah, no, let's uh, let's start the story. Um, uh, okay, last time, uh, in part three. Uh, ah, sorry, it's live. I'm getting uh, ah, get my jitters out. Right, you're getting, you gotta worked, work those jitters. Uh, Coda, your screen's dead. Now it's working. Cool. It's working on my end, and so um, hey, I got the OBS, so my version's gonna look great. Um, <laughs> you're right. Okay. You're beautiful. All right. Wait. Um, I can't hear you. Who? Who? Who can't you hear? Uh, Dex. <laughs> you're not talking. Oh boy. I haven't been talking. That's why you can't hear me. Okay, but sometimes you think Flash is green. Okay, cool. That's all good. Um, all right. Yeah, these, Damn. these things pick up a lot of different sounds. Yep. Let's pick up right, my neighbors. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright. Allow me to set the scene. Alright. Alright. Right. Um, after, uh, after Samantha's um, living UFO was defeated by the monster freaks, um, she decided to take matters into her own, into her own hands. Um, as the uh, three, um, as our three heroes arrive at their jobs at the Bella Theater, um, a... Ex um, a, uh, an exasperated Johan, their boss, and former um, gold and former gold phantom monster freak, um, runs um, to tell them the bad news. My friends, my friends, <laughs> the worst possible um, news has happened. On He's going to come here, Samantha. Red turn. Wait, hold on, real quick. You're telling me. Your crazy ex-girlfriend, who we've been trying to fight against, has is now deciding to get here. Okay, we never dated, but <laughs> I mean, with a name. Up. Hold on, back up, back up. Uh, as <laughs> come on, I mean, you're telling you're you're hyping up how beautiful she is. Come on. I have, I have. Okay, I, I, if you look back on the episodes, I have a pretty <laughs> Like <laughs> All right, I, I, Johan. <laughs> Johan. Why? Anyways, anyways, ignore, ignore me, Johan. All right, blue turn. Er, red turn. Or, oh yeah, no. Uh, um, Coda. Everybody start. Um, everybody starts this game with a point. Oh, really? okay. Yeah, and um, also give uh, uh, give Ty a point. For um, uh, talking trash. That's um, a red ranger action. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, blue turn. <clears throat> okay, so she's coming here. Um, does she have a res? Oh, a what? A reservation. Have we like? Reserved a theater room for her or whatever. Maybe the conference hall that we have here. I mean, has she paid her ticket? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm 
I'm taking it. I'm taking it as normal action. Um, no, uh, she seems to want to parlay. I'm I'm thinking about getting the fold-out tables and just putting a nice cloth on top of them. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, uh. The nice ones or the ones we just picked up from the uh, dollar store. Well, the the, the ones dollar the store. Dollar store, but they look nice. Dollar store. All right, so I go and I get the stuff set up. Okay, right, cool. Uh, pink turn. turn. Wow, three monsters in this. Georgie wants to see us. That's technically three dates. Well, you know, we've been doing a pretty good job at trouncing her. Jay, you're not supposed to laugh. You're not in the room. <laughs> what is this, Carrie? This is a small theater. Small? How did I... You're telling me well, I... Now. It's... <laughs> so we're in a box. Well, it's nice. Like it's got like a, it's, it's got like one big area where you like you can like have you know old celluloid movies play. But like beyond that, it is a small little lobby with like a bit of a pit. My eyes are. I don't, I don't like. I don't see the Bella Theater being like a huge like multiplex theater or anything. Um, it's like a twoplex. Well, like. There's at could, though, it's like, got, like there is an attic in a basement. We have established that. It's big enough for that. Yeah. Well, logi well logistics of the bell of uh, the bell theater aside, um, <laughs> time uh, passes, and the monster freaks and Johan stand behind the fold-out table with the very nice-looking five-dollar um, <laughs> the five-dollar tarp, as um, a limousine rolls up to the theater. Uh, One-eyed, gray-scale, um, gray-skinned creatures called um, Yigors open the. D they're the mooks, like um, like putty patrollers. Uh, they open the door, and their mistress, in a crimson red business suit, uh, business pantsuit, um, um, steps out and enters the theater with the swagger of a thousand suns. Oof. Red turn. Guys, I called it. She's hot. She's a crazy ex-girlfriend, I called it. She's hot. <laughs> Gain a point for, um, shit-talking. How is that shit-talking? That's a lovely compliment. You're telling us more, right? No, but you're still kind of, I don't know. Yeah, I'm like, okay, so before we have the point, um, I would argue that, um, you're still, like, um, are you still trying to make fun of, uh, yo are you still trying to make fun of Johan, or is this a personal comment? The, uh, I'm making light of the situation, so I would say it's a it's a comment. Oh, your personal comment in the regular turn. Ignore point. Blue turn. Well, I mean, this form is uh, kind of preferable to the giant top snakes. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> so, is this canon where Ty just completely? Routinely forgets the big, huge, like, uh, uh, vision that we all had when we got back to his place. If you want to, <laughs> I, I am, I am, I am, uh, it's some lights aren't there. I thought we established that, like, I go on tangents and I forget my own, uh, livelihood very often. Okay, okay. so I'm referencing the vision that we had where we saw her as a giant cloud of miasma and snakes and the previous um, monster freaks uh, took her down several pegs. Yes. Hot Elvira is the preferable form. <laughs> Hot Elvira. <laughs> Big PP. Big PP's up. Let me go down to blue, uh, see if I can interpret that in any way. Um... React, take temporary cover, take action, uh, leaving self vulnerable, display the uh, precise, uh, try to pinpoint adversaries weak, uh, point out the obvious to others. Yeah, no, she's hot. That's, um, that is an obvious. That's pretty thing. obvious. Yeah, you point. Ah. Two for two on hotness. Wait, 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 no. Sorry, might be. Point out the obvious is a regular turn. <laughs> Sorry, I forget sometimes, guys. Pink turn. That's a red major move. Okay. So, uh, so, so, 
Panther just just got out of the limo, right? Yeah. Okay. I just hope this goes uh, goes smoothly. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, running through pink turns. Uh, let's see. Heavy turns. Strike at the heart of the problem. Remain uh, positive and cheerful. And then see. Uh, take action. React, taking temporary cover, display initiative, and find it. Try to rally the squad um, in a disagreement. Just be there for someone. All right, the um, yeah, you're trying to be there for everybody. You're trying to be like, <laughs> you know what, guys? Just hope this works out. Cool. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, so that's a regular turn. All right, um, Samantha, op all right, um, one of the Igors opens the door, gentleman-like for Samantha. You can imagine a um, like four foot tall gray scaled creature um gray skinned creature wearing a nice uh <laughs> like a little black suit <laughs> uh, opening a door putting its arm over its chest being like lady <laughs> <laughs> uh, <clears throat> um she enters the theater and behind her there are three other yaigors each holding um a, each holding a um nice briefcase samantha speaks all right guys Let's be honest. We can, uh, we've like, like it's it's a tale of all this time, you know. Big, evil, snake monster lady, heroes and pretty spandex. Like, well, like, you're gonna fight. I'm gonna retaliate. I, uh, when I retaliate, you're just gonna have a reason to fight me. So instead, I'm gonna give you these. The Three, um, the three Igors carrying briefcases um, come close to the uh, fold-out table. They br um, bring the briefcases on the table. They press the latch and opens up. Each one contains a billion dollars. I am willing to give each of you a billion dollars to just put your rings down and walk away. Red turn. By putting our rings down, are you talking about like our finger? Because technically, it's pretty symbiotic to my skin. Like I, I couldn't take it off in the shower. Like how off are you talking? Like lubricant, or are we talking like surgical? Yeah, blue turn. Um, I would take the money, but a billion dollars doesn't really go that far. So, uh, my vote's for no. Plus, we get to keep, uh, sweet superpower rings. I enjoy my spandex. Yeah, it's, it's quite, uh, comfortable. You, it you breathes. It really <laughs> breathes. Pink turn. Ah, uh, the, the offer is tempting if I, if we didn't already work at the theater. <laughs> I do want to point out, guys, my chat saying, it's a billion dollars, man. It would last you for a long time. <laughs> Rebutes? Oh, yeah, Re rebuttals? Sure. Um, okay, like, but after, after I pay off my debts, after I uh, buy a house and whatever. And, like, what about a medical bill that we actually ran out from? Okay, no, no, no. Tell you what. Ask the chat. Tell you what. I got a question for the chat. Um... Okay, would you be able, like, how would you, okay, would you be able to spend a billion dollars within a four-month period of time in which, with the end of that, which in, uh, ah, ah? in the end of four months, the world's going to end. So, what do you think about that, chat? Uh, yeah. I, I can see the comments just going, man, screw it. I don't, I don't care. I'll be dead by then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we'll leave the that comment in the chat. What would you do within four months? Right, cool. Offering money to uh, leave her alone to the, to, uh, to uh, destroy the world or something. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. No, we have um. So yeah, no, you never have to say your turn, Mar. Ah, Mar. Sorry. Uh, what was you? What do you want to say? Oh no, 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 no. Nothing important. Nothing. So Mar, Mar just stands there and shrugs, I guess. But no, I didn't. I had my. I forgot what you said. Could you repeat it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I said something about uh, if we were, if we weren't already making money at the theater, it would have been a tough right, right, offer. Right. That's, that was it. I'm just trying to like get back to where we were in the story. Thank you. Yes, that was exactly what you said. Um, I believe on uh, 
I believe that's uh. Let's see. I'm trying to give you points here. Um. <laughs> I don't think I was looking to get a point for that nerd. <laughs> <laughs> Samantha stands there, takes a moment, um, takes a moment in frustration, but ultimately respects the decision. She shrugs respectfully and replies, Okay, fair enough. I respect your resolve, heroes. My response will be here within the hour. Bye. And she, <laughs> Samantha and her Yigors um, pack up, leave, and uh, pack up, leave. However, um, as a... Uh, token of their appreciation for meeting and as a goodbye a Yigor does leave a um, fruit basket where the fruit is decorated to look like flowers red turn that went pretty well I actually thought she was gonna blow up the place when we when we when she said no when, when, when we said no I thought she was gonna just blow us up right there you know unarmored we would have actually died I think Turn. An edible arrangement. Yeah. Pink turn. An edible? Hey, not getting high. We're not supposed to get high right now. We're teenagers. Well, scratch that. We're powered people, but we can't get high right now. No, no, I'm, I, I, no, I'm trying to, I'm trying to figure out if, uh, if this is an edible or inedible. Edible. <laughs> Edible, like fruit. Okay, never mind. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, so, so then, in that case. And nutritious, too. Okay. Yo, I know. Johan, um, turns to his, um, young employees and speaks. Okay, so, within the hour, she's gonna do something. Knowing her, she likes big, but she likes to uh, be big when she is rejected. Oh, Eva. Red turn. You can tell by her hair. <laughs> oh, God. If she doesn't take re uh, <laughs> rejection very well, dear God. Hope oh, God. Um, Hold on. Uh, to go back on what the chat's saying... Uh, the guy, the the one person uh, did say that he would just buy a lot of energy drinks. He'll die before the four months. He'll go on a speed run, take some people with him. That's what he would do with a billion dollars. Take take people with you. Oh, what what a what a um kind soul. <laughs> All right, so did so to, so so with my action, I'm. <laughs> What kind of reaction are we talking about? Um, Johan, can you actually tell us the last time she's been rejected? Blue turn. I'm still stuck on the Elvira lookalike giving us an edible arrangement as a consolation. For rejecting her. Okay, yeah. I'm <laughs> I'm counting that as a failure to react. Uh, give Jay a point. Um, <laughs> there's, um, she's about to do something terrible, but oh no, the edible arrangement. Um, <laughs> yeah, it, feels, it feels so passive aggressive. I'm just like... It's like, oh wait, no, no, not candy. Not a box of chocolates. Edible arrangement. Yeah, like, what if I don't like fruit? Maru, are you gonna give Jay the point? Jay, I mean Maru. Okay. <laughs> that, that's your 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 goal your um your scorekeeper right now. <laughs> I, I know I know. Cool. But, uh, uh, all right, now but it's your turn as well. Pink turn. Right, right. Man, I. I sure hope, uh, I sure hope she at least has someone to talk to about, about, about rejection. Oh yeah, so it's, uh, being there for someone who, um, doesn't deserve it. Um, <laughs> um give yourself a point. Um, okay. 
<laughs> Alright, uh, so um, in order, Johan responds. Um, <laughs> it's like, a, well, the last time she was rejected, she uh, woke up a terrible eldritch horror the size of ten, the, the size of a ten story building, and it went on a rampage and destroyed um, Taipei. <laughs> and then, um, that's, like, it wasn't a. I, 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 that's a, I think maybe she's um dating uh, her assistant. The uh, uh, was it a, the tomb warden? That's my response to uh, that's Johan's response to Mark. And then um as to uh, um Jay's response to the edible arrangement, Johan takes one of the pineapple flowers and just takes a bite out of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um. So all right, so I'm gonna use my narrator. So I'm gonna use my narrator powers to move uh, time forward. Um, Forty-five minutes have passed, and the team have completely um, just completely eaten the edible arrangement. And there is a giant whiteboard full of ideas of like uh, <laughs> full of ideas of what she could do in terms of summoning giant monsters. Uh, red turn. Maybe she's bringing out a horde of pinheads and just protruding everyone like the UFO monster. Okay, blue turn. I really kind of hope that she uh, brings up an Eldritch God. I mean, if the world's going to end, like, at least have a deity experience. Wait, so you want to experience a God? Sure. I, uh, complex. Okay, <laughs> turn. Uh. Um. I got nothing. I'm still. I'm. I got nothing. I'm just fiddling around with the bas basket of the. Uh, <laughs> of the uh, you're you're tossing around the basket. Well, you're react, give yourself a point. <laughs> you're you're just tossing around a basket that had the food that we just ate. That's all you're doing. As long as I use my ADHD, I'll tell them the world. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's definitely how we're going to save the world. By you fiddling with your basket. Get your hand off your dick. Come on. Alright. Okay, Mr. Okay, Mr. Well, she is hot. <laughs> she is! I'll die from a hot chick. Stepping on my face. Okay. After that turn, I'm gonna play off of a. Uh, since uh, most of you did uh, regular turns, and uh, so I got two regular turns I can play off of, and a light turn. Here becomes um, like we're gonna start um, <coughs> ramping things up with my narrator powers. Oh All right, God. So, uh, the two regular turns. Um, in response to you, um, there's gonna be an earthquake, and uh, there's gonna be an earthquake that um, both uh, Ty and Jay notice. All right, and then um, for in, and in response to the light turn, um, Maru instead of playing with his basket, um, while playing with his basket, um, <laughs> turns his head for a second and sees a giant reptilian foot crash um, in the this like land in the street and lift itself up. <laughs> All right, red turn. Oh god, why is the floor rumbling? Shoot! Did I leave the washer on? Blue turn. What's wrong with your washer that you think this is it? Oh no, I shit my pants a lot. Excuse me, I shit my pants more than I should. <laughs> well there you go, that's um uh submitting your humility, that's a Red Ranger attack. Um, <laughs> <laughs> No, it's not a point. That's just a task. That's like a character growth thing. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, pink turn. Oh, was that a was that a giant lizard leg? <laughs> I'd say it's a frog, but probably lizard. Johan um turns up. Johan um walks out. Johan steps outside, looks down at the crater that was a footstep and turns to see 
a uh, massive creature, a massive creature that is equal parts gorilla and killer whale. It can only be. <laughs> oh no! It can only be whale gorilla. <laughs> <laughs> We're fighting Moby Dick. All right. I mean, it's it's. So does someone got like a, a little spear, a little big PP to like kill Moby Dick? Not not to, not to joke about your euphemism, but like Moby Dick. <laughs> All right. Um, let's, I'm gonna take that as a normal turn. Blue turn. I'm kind of disappointed. <laughs> Oh, no, that's a, that's a thing you can do. One second. Um, this is I'm ruin something perfectly. Fail to react effectively. Um, become de uh, become demoralized by a setback. Uh, become demoralized by a setback. <laughs> oh wow, I thought that was gonna be scary, but it's not. Um, give uh, Jay a point. Yeah, it's like it's like King Willy. Yeah. I that's the nightmares of the fifth dimension. Like. Me. I was. <laughs> yeah. I was expecting someone out of your worst nightmares, but no, that's just a uh, that's just a whale with gator legs. Uh oh, um, I got a mute on uh, your uh, screen there. Um. Yeah, my roommate's calling me. Oh, gotcha. All right, um, pink turn. Uh, oh yeah, pink turn, and also give Jay a point. All right. You know, I'm sure I'm sure he's a formidable foe, but who who named him? <laughs> Who named it? <laughs> Johan? Do you know about this? Okay, well, Wellrilla is an ancient creature. The massive race is known as the Kite. They are. I'm sorry, you're breaking up. They you called them, uh, what is the, the scientific term? A, um. Big, big. So, anyway, big, um. Big. There are many, there are many ones. Wellrilla is only, um, in fact, Wellrilla is actually part of a trinity. There is, um, the five head, there's the five head of Hydradora, and there is even the, um, giant pterosaur-like creature known as Pandadan, which is a giant pa half panda, half, um, pterodactyl thing. Wait. Well, yeah. That sounds like something I want to... That doesn't sound like something, uh... The pan... So, wait, a, a, a build... We're so... The other options were a five-headed dragon or a build-a-bear. What, a, a pterodactyl build-a-bear? A pterodactyl build-a-bear. Okay, so a bear that flies. Okay, that can rain shit and claws. All right. Hmm. That, uh... I mean... The, dra the five-headed dragon definitely sounded much more drastic. Okay. Um... Was actually, um, uh, reacting off of everyone's regular turns, um, using my narrator power. In the and um, a weird and a weird of uh, like and like a weird flood is beginning to happen. However, it's not water; it's some kind of viscous red liquid. A um, five-headed and like um, and then y'all turn. And um, down the street, there is a five-headed snail with um, dra uh, the, uh, uh, yeah, five-headed snail, each head being a dragon, a dragon head, and a um, panda with pterodactyl wings, um, poorly trying to keep itself in the air, falling into buildings, uh, falling into um, buildings, <laughs> then picking itself up and flying again. Uh, <laughs> red turd, react. Jay, why didn't you shut me up? I do this to us all the time. <laughs> Blue turn. He's speechless. Blue, oh. Blue turn. Oh, he might be doing the phone call. Okay, pink turn. Okay, blue turn. <laughs> uh, that, blue is uh, blue. Failed to react. Give him a point. Um, red turn. <laughs> red, red turn. Sorry, pink. 
Well, crap, we have lost a... <laughs> we lost our ranger, holy Jeez. shit! <laughs> he fainted! Uh, uh... Well, Jay's left the call, so we're just gonna treat this as, um... Jay just kinda like, uh, Jay just kinda went... <laughs> what? Did you see, he just like, blue screen, we'll treat him as like, um, heroic blue screen of death. He's just demoralized by this whole thing. <laughs> okay, cool, so... Or, or we can, yeah, or we can take, or we can have a short break. <laughs> Whatever, uh, but I do already know what to say. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, let's just go ahead, it's your turn. Okay. Um. Oh, wow, that... That looked more like a normal giant monster than I, than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Alright, um... So... If you guys want, we can, uh... We can, we can continue forward with, um, like, uh, with, in canon, Jay just kind of being like, no, that, that panda thing is way too stupid. And he's just, like, <laughs> trying to figure it out in his head. And then you guys can, like, um, and then you guys can keep going with the, uh, keep moving the story forward. And, um, we can just give, uh, Jay another free point. Or we can, like, uh, take a break for a second. We can take a break. Yeah, we can take a break. He shouldn't, uh, take that long on the phone then. Oh, uh, yeah. Sure. Um, Wait, what? Okay, cool. And you're gonna... Yeah, you... the, actually, normally we, we split this into twos anyway, so yeah, uh, yeah when uh, Jay gets back, we'll do part two. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. But then, wait, you're going back to Solitaire? God freaking damn it. <laughs> 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 okay, so... It's actually kind of funny because uh, my viewers is mentioning how, like, my whole bit with... Uh, well, the stepping on is actually going to be step kept on Twitch forever. <laughs> uh, I feel like I, was, I I do apologize for being a little, like, too, like, uh, jumping the gun. It's all good. Jay, is that you? Yep. You feeling yep. better? Discord crashed on my computer. God. Okay, cool. It'd be like of course it would be because we saw monsters and you just like were confused the fuck. Yeah, yeah no, no. So the way we're treating it in canon is um uh you you just kind of got like heroic blue screen of death. You're just knowing your character. You just went no, that panda thing thing is way too stupid. You just kind of went uh. <laughs> Pretty much. I'm and I, you got a point. And I was yelling at you for why didn't you shut me up because the shit happens to this all the time, whenever I talk. Like the movie theater, we wouldn't have been there if I didn't open my mouth. And he's gone again. There he goes. There he goes. <laughs> I'm talking so much crap that he's uh, <laughs> AFK again. Yeah, he'll be back. He, it's fine. His thing, his uh, apparently his he said that his things, his uh, Discord is feeling a little weird, doing a little weird. Yeah. Um. Tell him. Uh... Normally he does like normally he goes through the um uh, the web browser. Um, I told him to, I told him like in order to see video to use the uh to use like the app. Uh, maybe go back to the web browser. Mm. I'm I'm using the desktop uh, app and things are still going fine. Yeah, I'm using the desktop app too, so I'm just wondering if it's um something else. Is that you? Yeah. Ooh, he's live. He's alive. You want to speak up? Can you hear? They're a little broken up, but... That, um, you're also a little soft. You there? Am I here? Yes! You're- I can hear you now. Alright, back with the show. Um, alright, so, you, um, you, um, all, uh, all four of you were there, Johan, um, Jay, Ty, Maru, um, you're there, you're, um, you see the pro- you see the monsters, you see the problem, how you gonna handle it? Ready? 
red yeah. turn. This is after my outburst with uh, Jay, right? Yeah. Okay. Johan, please, can, uh, f for the sake of us being able to fight these monsters, please tell me these monsters do not combine. Do they combine? No? Oh, they God. Just, oh, God. Just, uh, I don't know how that would work. Do we have humanoid versions of our mechs because if there's three of them we only have one megazord all right um you you fr um you fractaled out there for a second uh, um but to uh, to respond to your is, yeah is that a no that's that sounds like a no hello okay, um all right, um, to respond to your thing, I, I got as um, uh, just from a narrator uh, standpoint, not really. Not really. Uh, no, your mechs do not have humanoid modes. It is a uh, giant crocodile, a giant bat, and a um, gorilla-themed Frankenstein. Fork. All right, so okay. But there is a fly. But there is a flying panda, and a. Hydra snail that you know probably needs to keep its moisture near the water and a uh, you know a gorilla uh, whale that's just kind of like you know roaming around the city and you know that that kind of seems like you guys have a uh, land sea um, air based arsenal just kind of putting it out there. <laughs> oh God, Jay. I need your head working, please. Are you done being shocked by the amount of monsters that are in front of us and the weird panda tagnal? Blue turn. We're just, we're just gonna suit up, right? Yeah, we should probably suit up, but uh, like, do you have a plan? Because I have nothing. Um, kill him dead for <laughs> bothering to exist. It's a little harsh, don't you think? <laughs> Even for giant, dangerous monsters. <laughs> uh, you said dangerous. That's enough already. <laughs> <laughs> they're dangerous. They're monsters. They're not even good monsters. Just kill them dead. They're just, they're just there's some f figment of our imagination. It's just a fever dream. Maybe the fruit's doing this to us. Maybe we ate the fruit and it was drugged and we're seeing this shit. No. Fuck. It is really happening. I would know. I am a real monster and not a human with monster powers. You're a short... You're a swart... You're a short man with dwarf syndrome. There's no difference between that and a monster. Fair enough. Anyway, you guys want to, like, uh... You want Henshin and everything? Alright, you guys ready? Alright. Uh, Alright, guys. One, two, three... Henshin! Henshin! Henshin. Alright. Get, uh, take away a point from everybody. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Now, in a um, dazzle of light, um, J uh, Ty becomes uh, Dracula. Ty becomes Dracula Red, um, having a um, a kind of like a nice, really, uh, really, a really badass suit um, themed Red Ranger outfit. It's kind of Lupin Ranger, uh, Lupin Ranger ish. Uh, Maru is. Um, Pharaoh Pink, um, he has like this really badass regal and pink, uh, regal gold and pink armor with kind of like a tattered uh, mummy uh, striped skirt, uh, back skirt at the bottom. And then you have Jay, who is Frankenstein Blue, who is this um, badass armored um, Hulk of a Blue Ranger. Okay, so you guys are armored up, and there's giant monsters, and you each have a point. Do you want to summon your mechs, or do you want to um, tackle the problem individually? Because if you all summon your mechs right now, you know you get a point. Because I forget it's a team action. Wait, it's a team action if we do this together? Yeah, if you do, if you um, if you um, agree to do a task um, together at the same time, it's a group action, remember? And then within a group action, um, yeah, if you confront, the, yeah. 
if you um, confront danger together, and, or if you are um, about to do an ultimate attack, or um, um, have your mech do the ultimate form, it counts as a um, group turn. So if you guys want it, so but if you want it to count as a group turn, you can all do individual actions. Boys, would you like to gang up on these guys one at a time, or do you feel confident to like smash and grab by yourself? I don't feel confident. I don't understand that panda dactyl. It's beyond me. Okay, fine. Let's just run the train on them. <laughs> run the train. Steamroller. Alright. Alright, so all of us gang up on each of these one at a time. Okay, cool. So, um, you're so yeah, so, so like, um, summon your max, and then uh, you're each gonna take, try and take one at a time. <laughs> do we say it? Do we say it at the same time or like? Yeah, you want to see? You want to do it? One, two, three. Rise, monster, max. Yes. Okay. 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 Right. What? One, two, three. Rise, rise monster, rise, max. Rise, max. So in sync. Or we're not physically right. together. Um, <laughs> from the clouds descends the megabat. It um, uses um, some kind of uh, sonic teleportation technology to grab uh, Ty, um, Dracula Red, and place him in the cockpit of um, the Megabat. It flies off to um, take on its aerial, its, aerial, its aerial nemesis, the Panda Dactyl. Um, the um, out of nowhere um, comes tromping by the um, uh, massive monster, um, Jay's uh, Jay. Frankenstein Blues, um, gorilla themed Frankenstein mech. It um, picks it up. It picks um, Jay up with its hand, places it inside the cockpit, and continues its knuckle dragging to go fight um, gorilla. Go fight the um, uh, <laughs> um, whale rilla. Wait, hold on. I thought we were fighting them um, together. Oh, well, yeah, no. But, uh, okay, so you're all going to fight the. So, okay, so never mind. So, anyway, um, all the cool mech capture stuff still happens, but we're going to talk about how we're going to attack them in a second. And then um, out of the seas comes uh, Maru's mech. It opens its mouth, descending uh, sorry, um, descending a um, staircase. Maru walks up the staircase and is inside the cockpit of the Nile crocodile. All three mechs are summoned. And um, okay, so you guys want to summon your mechs, have those out, but um, you want to take on one monster at a time. Who do you want to go for first? Uh, let's see. Uh, before that, the, was there any uh, changes to the points? No oh, changes to the points. No, you summoned your uh, mechs together as a group action. You're facing danger together. Um, so you um, so like you would be so you would gain and it's so like um, you would uh gain and lose a point. So just no, everything stays the same. Okay. Yeah. So um, take out air first. Okay, so you guys want to do panda dactyl first? Yeah, sure. Yeah, definitely. I noticed the panda um, had. You go ahead. Okay, since this is a live stream, and um, since since there's like really no sense of a, like how to like how many like life points a monster has, um, I'm gonna go ahead and say if you guys can land um, three hits on it, like if if you land three hits on a monster, the monster's defeated. Like that's how I'm gonna treat like these like how I'm gonna treat this live stream. Okay. Okay. As long as you can land them. So make sure you can commit to turns. <laughs> 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 Alright. So uh, the team uh, rides their mechs and uh, sees Pandadactyl, which is bumbling its way, um, trying to get to its, uh, <laughs> bumbling its way through the city. It uh, stops for a second and picks up one of the, it picks up a uh, tall building, begins eating it like a bamboo wreath. <laughs> Red turn. Damn, he's as hungry as we are. Shit. All right, Jay, do you think you can? Wait, hold on. I got an idea. Jay, are you able to throw Maru at him, or should or should I just swoop in from behind? All right, blue turn. Um, let's see. Wait, don't you have? Capable. Is my mech capable of throwing Maru's mech? Yes. Okay. Um, I launched a croc missile. <laughs> launched a croc. Aru, what's up? What do you think? 
Are you okay with this? Hold on. We forget that. We did ask for permission. Whatever works, I guess. <laughs> so, so he's like, so you're picking him up and he's being tossed at G velocity going, ah! Okay. So, um, I'm going to count that as a, uh, so I'm going to count that as a, uh, so it's your plan, uh, to you, so it's your plan, so I'm going to, so it's Red Ranger's plan, so I'm going to count that as, um, use your weapon to drive off an opponent. <laughs> 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 So, Mar- so like a gain of- so uh, Ty gains a point um, by uh, so Ty swoops behind the panda, scaring it. Um, the panda gets spooked, and then um, Jay, like doing that turn since um. Okay, actually, special turn. Actually, I'm um, sorry, blue turn. Uh, special blue turn is activated. Um, uh, you accepted uh, support from a uh, stronger teammate. I'm just, since Red Ranger's leader, I'm just going to count stronger as, like, higher rank. Um, you, uh, you do not lose a token if you commit to heavy action, which would be, um, yeah, so, um, you, so, yeah, um, if you want to commit a heavy action, you're not going to lose a, t- you're not going to lose a point anytime in the future, so hold on to that, um, knowledge. Okay. So you can take heavy actions. Um, and then for pink, that would be that normal turn for pink. You're good. All right. And going on to my narrator rules. Okay. Um, you all did a, let's see, you all committed heavy. Let's see, all right. So you all committed heavy turns, which means, um, I can respond with my light turns. Um, All right, cool. Um, actually, uh, yeah, I'm already putting one of you on the spot because you're going to throw Maru at a um, panda. <laughs> so, <laughs> all right, so, um, so yeah, Megabat spooks, the pan- uh, spooks Pandadactyl. Pandadactyl tries to, do- um, tries to dodge uh, Megabat only for it to be um, speared by um, <laughs> Jay's um, massive monster. Uh, chucking the Nile crocodile directly at the panda. So now <laughs> the panda is in pain and um, extremely angry and has a crocodile mech sticking through it. <laughs> oh god, that's gruesome. I can't even imagine. People, I'm sorry as I'm broadcasting it like to the public. I'm sorry for the panda blood. <laughs> Blue turn. Would I be able to um, electrocute Maru's mech without harming Maru? <laughs> no, but you can electrocute the mech to stop the monster, but Maru would take the hit. <laughs> Wait, so how do, how do we take damage then? By being by taking damage. Yeah, but like, um, so my question is like, are we gonna? So you they said like you get um, you get uh, three strikes you're out. Is okay, cool. Like that that'll be up to you then. Um, pink turn. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Okay, that worked. I wish I knew how to open the- open the gator's mouth, though. (laughs) Let me see. Oh, there we go. How about this one? (laughs) That worked. (laughs) Okay. Um, so... Maru opens the mouth of the gator. <laughs> Sorry, opens the mouth of uh, the Nile crocodile, which gives it enough le- <laughs> which gives it enough um, pressure to slightly push itself out. Um, the mouth then closes, and the alligator um, slowly slides itself out of uh, Pandadactyl's gut. And Pandadactyl just kind of like gets on all fours and breathes heavy, but is still pretty angry. Um, uh, Mar- <laughs> um and then uh, the other, t- and then it's, yeah, that's the end of the turn. Um, red turn. <sighs> cool. Um, wait, do I? I want to use Brooding Slash, but is there a variant with my mech? Uh, no, I think your mech, um, something I'm going to go into here. Um, so your mech's got like, um, your mech has bladed wings. Yeah, sure. Your mech has bladed wings. You want to do a uh, brooding slash through your mech? 
and three. Yeah, three. Uh, let's see. So, all right, uh, bad boy, brooding slash. Okay, cool. Uh, blue turn. Um, so Marlo is no longer inside the panda pterodactyl. I was inside the panda pterodactyl. Yeah. You you were inside the panda pterodactyl. Blue turn. <laughs> okay, so, uh, to um, get a sense of where everybody is, Marlo's not near the monster, anymore, right? He's um on the ground, but he's coated in but he's coated in a pool of its blood, and that pool is leading up to the um uh, pandadactyl. <laughs> that's that's surprisingly uh, viscous. Grotesque. <laughs> are you are you are you alluding to that it can die? Well, if you were if you were to make that choice, but keep in mind, <laughs> it's it's your teammate on the line here. <laughs> if he takes three what hits, he's out. Down. Um. All right. So I, mean, I don't need uh, an electric based attack. I um, use a cannon. You do what now? I use one of my electric cannons. Oh okay, yeah, cool. You um, launch a volley. Uh, blue turn. That was blue turn. <laughs> that was... Sorry, pink turn. <laughs> uh, oh my god, it looks a lot of gross, but I think it could be... But I think we could do something with it. What would you like to do then? Yeah, Mario, what are you gonna do with... What are you gonna do with that viscous sauce? <laughs> what are you gonna do? To react. Um, <laughs> we could do something about it. Like what? Something. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool. So um, award yourself a point and um, take a point away from uh, take a point away from Ty and Jay. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, All right. Your attacks successfully hit Pandadactyl. Um, that is, uh, right, that's three direct hits. Pandadactyl um, explodes on the uh, cellular level, creating a um, Super Sentai style explosion. Oh, never mind about the blood. Then. <laughs> <laughs> and all the blood explodes too. Damn it! <laughs> Wait, does that mean that Mario gets damage? Cool. No. Uh, Alright, since that was two heavy turns and a light turn, um, I can respond thusly. Um, cool. Um, yeah. Alright. Um, okay, so um, Massive Monster is body checked by um, Whale Rilla and um, Hydra and um, the. What was it? it was like Hydra Dora. Um, uses its um, goopy tentacles to grab a uh, tie out of the sky. And then um, in reaction to uh, the light turn, uh, I can do a heavy thing. Um, Mac, the uh, last step of the previous plan. Uh, um, what, okay, all right. Actually, yeah, I could do this. Um, in reaction to the light turn uh, Maru made, while all of you are attacking these monsters, Samantha returns to the Bell. Uh, Samantha returns to the Bella Theater. Hmm. None of you know this yet, but she's. Uh, but she has returned to this theater. Back to your monster fight. Uh, red turn. Wait. So you tell me the uh, the five headed Udra um, grabs me, right? Yeah, it's, it's grabbed you out of the sky. So that is a point. Like um, so you've been hit. That's a point. Well, not 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 a literal point, but like you know, you once that's a strike. So you've been hit. Okay. So so him. So the guy like entangling me is a damage. Yeah. Yes. That's okay. A, that counts as a damage. Is that a damage before I get ejected or before I get KO'd? That's 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 like okay. You have a life point of three. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you now have two of three life points. If I were to charge headfirst into the 
monster would I, would that give me damage? Um, yeah, no, that that would damage it. Yeah, um, you'd um, you take it'd be your last point though. It would be my last HP. No, your last um, your last counter. Sorry, your last um, hard um, hard um, turn counter. Okay. Hmm. Maru, help me! I don't like where this is going. We've okay. watched enough shows. Sorry, was that too loud? Okay, um, I'm gonna count that as um. Why won't someone um? This, I'm gonna count that as a uh. Actually, no, that's just a regular turn. You took action. Good job. Um. <laughs> By just um, talking, me talking is good. Okay, cool. But um, oh wait, wait, but um, you did confide in Maru, correct? Yes. All right, Maru, give yourself a point. Maru, help me! I, I we've watched enough shows so we know where this is going. I don't like it. <laughs> okay, I don't know what I did, but sure. <laughs> oh, that's your special turn power. Um, okay. Um, blue turn. What's up, dude? You just got body checked. Okay. Um. Oh. Your special turn activated. Do you want to use it? That allow you to use a that allow you to make a heavy turn without spending a point. Uh yeah, sure. What's the what am I heavy turn? Um, you're um, you you were body checked by um, Whale Rilla, so um, you've been so like you're kind of like in a clash with this monster. Do you want to attack it and make it like hurt? Um, yes. Okay, uh, cool. That's what I'm just asking. All right, cool. That, that's your action. Um, <laughs> um, uh, oh, can I specify? Sure. Yeah. What's your, how you want to hurt him? Um, point blank cannon under the chin. There you go. Um, blue. All right. So pink turn. All right. Uh, all right. I, I got to. I got to tie. I go to a. I get close to. I get a. I get close to and attack the uh, most monster attacking a uh, tie. Okay, cool. Um, that counts as. Yeah, counts That's as just being there for someone. Cool, good job. Oh, um, that was my attempt to strike at the heart of the problem. Oh, you want to strike at the heart? Of the... Oh, you want to like um? Okay, attack it direct. Okay, strike at the heart of the problem. Cool. Then uh, yeah, take take away a point. Okay. All right, rest. So um. Going off what just happened, um, the Maru rushed in and saved uh, Ty. Ty is free from uh, Hydra Dora's um, gra um, gooey grasp. However, Maru is now um, clashing the creature, and Jay, the, um, Jay's uh, massive monster's cannons deliver a point blank uh, blast at um, Whalerilla's chin, breaking it. And um, knocking him, breaking it, and knocking him, uh, slight, knocking him slightly off balance. In response to uh, your regular, in response to the regular turn, um, uh, yes, I'm going to um, separate you guys. So now it's um, Maru and Jay are um, so, yeah, Maru. No, sorry, no, it's Maru and Ty. You guys are going to deal with um, the Hydra monster, obviously, and um, you're on your and um. Jay, you are on your own with um, Whale Rilla. So that's how we're going to start this turn. Uh, red turn. Hmm. Am I allowed to attach myself to Maru so he has additional mobility? Sure. They, the, your mechs combined, yeah. Is what kind of turn would that be? That would be a hard turn. So you would be um. So now it would be a um. So now you would be a you have uh, combined your mechs into um a uh, Nile crocodile um shadow wing mode. So that would be um. So you would waste your um. You you would um waste your um your one red turn to combine with Maru. Mm. So you have no points left, but you are now a combined unit with Maru. How would that affect my HP? Your HP? Okay, um, tell you what. Since Maru hasn't been hit what that way yet, um, I'm going to count it as... It'll be like a reset. You're now a new mech, so it's 3 HP now. 
Mar, are you okay if I get on you so you can be faster? Skip to tank turn. Yes. Um, do you, um, how you want to, um, do you want to combine? That sounds like a great idea. All right, Crazy group action. Uh, group action to combine. You waste no points. Um, the uh, mech sequence starts. Um, the um, the Nile crocodile extends itself, and the um, mega bat. Um, connects itself between the um, split rivets. Now it is a um, crocodile with um, giant bladed bat wings. Does he have access to my moves then? You all, yes, um, you have access to both moves. So now you have a drill spin, a um, bladed wings, um, and sonic uh, blast. There you and go, Maru. Teeth and claws. There you go, Maru. I, I beefed you up. I love you. Alright, cool. Blue turn. Now, now you're the blue, now, now blue scene. Blue turn. Your versus whale Rilla. How you gonna handle it? Um, <clears throat> I am going to uh, alternate melee attacks and electric attacks. I'm oh, going see, to whale. I'm going to I'm going to whale on <laughs> the whale. <laughs> okay, gotcha. <laughs> okay, start. Um. Okay, so uh, yeah, spam. Uh, Take away a point from Jay. Okay. Cool. All right. So that is a um. All right. So how I'm gonna handle that is uh. Your um your fist strike true with a um mat with uh, your fist strike true and you continue to um bust the broken jaw of Whale Rilla. That's a double. That's um that's a hit. That's um now two hits against him. Um. Back to your guys. Um. You've now combined. And that being a group action, I'm going to respond that as a regular turn. There we go. Um, the uh, Hydra um, Hydra Dora begins attacking civilians. Like it just start like um in like out of like a uh, fear of like you trying to strike it, it begins attacking civilians and um putting it all over and putting them all over its body as a shield. Um, and then as for um, uh, Whale Rilla, um, he responds by um, grabbing uh, the feet of the massive monster and slamming it uh, to the ground. Therefore, that's a... So now, uh, Massive Monster is a 2 out of 3 points... Uh, 2 out of 3 um, HP. Uh, you guys... Um, was it um, Shadow... Um, was it um, Nile Crocodile Shadow Wing Mode? That still has full HP, but now you have the dilemma of Human Shield. <laughs> so... Beginning with, um, so we're now going to do red and pink scene. Red turn, go. <sighs> Damn it, I wish we can, uh, radio Johan. Because I, I, I want to know if our sonic emitters can actually release, uh, the people trapped on the slime. Dang it. Okay, uh, pink turn. Yeah, no, right. I don't want to hurt the people. We, we can't do that. Can we eat them and then have them stay in your mouth? Uh. You know what? This is a good robot. It's worth a job. Can we? Do you want to try to eat some people? Okay, cool. I don't want to try. Um, I, I how you handling your fight, Blue Turn? Um. Put my guard up to the next attack. Does it minimize damage? You see, you want to put your guard up. Yeah. Okay. So um, I'm gonna. Okay. So that counts as. Cool. That counts as a um, normal turn, and uh, those are. And then you guys um, make a. Uh, so I'm gonna treat. Um, and then you guys also make a normal turn to try and um, like eat the people off of uh, <laughs> off of um, uh, of of uh, Hydradora. Okay. Let's see. Um, cool. Okay. Um, the shadow uh, Nile crocodile shadowing mode. Uh, begins to um, softly um, rub its mouth against um, Hydradora, giving it the unwanted attention of like confusing Hydradora. Like, what the hell are you doing, man? 
but um, <laughs> it works. If you are successfully, um, your um, the mech is flying around and successfully licking all of the people off of him. <laughs> oh, so, so yeah. the, the gentle caress of our metallic lips have finally graped off the uh, civilians. All right, and as for um, blue turn, uh, you um, you successfully uh, defend yourself. However, um, you are now embedded into the, um, the you're now embedded into the road because his fist was strong enough to like push you into it. <laughs> so you're now trapped. You're not hurt, but you're trapped. You're incapacitated. Okay. All right, red turn. Maru, uh, drop him somewhere safe. Gotta find, uh, gotta find, gotta find a part of the town that's not covered in mucus or blood. <laughs> I mean, how far away from the theater? Um, not that far. Um, all right. So Maru, oh. <laughs> uh, okay. So yeah, I um, I got your guys' things there. Um, take a point away from Ty. Okay. Cool. Oh wait, yeah. How about the theater? I'm naked. You disengage the morph, so that's that counts as a transformation. Wait, wait. Did we actually disengage? Wait, hold on. Hey, I was, you didn't I, drop me off somewhere. I, no, I was asking, should we drop them off? Oh, okay. So you want to commit to the? Okay, so you want to move away to the Bella Theater then? Do, Maru, you're driving. Should we? That, yes, that seems like a safest place I can think of. Okay, that's just regular turns for both of you. Um, blue turn. How you gonna act? Um, from my position on the ground. Um, I want to shoot an electric attack. You want to what now? Shoot an electric attack. Okay, you want to go for an electric attack. Um, remove a point from Jay. He is bare naked. I'm, I'm doing something. I gotta defend myself. I'm trapped. <laughs> I have no right. backup. Your back against the wall. It's a real deal. It's not a joke. Jay commits to an electrical attack and successfully destroys um, Whale Rilla. It um, bubbles up, sparks, and explodes, um, as all monsters do. Um, <laughs> however, Jay is still stuck in the ground. Um, he has no power to run his mech. He is still in costume. He just has no ability. He just can't, doesn't have the, pow uh, the power to use his suit, but he's wearing it, so that's still good. Um, and the um, Hydra Dora begins to slither over to your mech. Thank God. We have civilians. Uh, uh, Nile Crocodile Shadow Wing Mode flies over and drops off the people at the Bella Theater. However, the Bella Theater has been busted wide open. Fork. Okay. Uh, Dang it. We, we... Up with this red turn. God damn it. Wait, hold on. Wait. Jay! Jay! Maru! We gotta get Jay first before we figure this out. Right, right. It's... Right, but I have people in, inside in my what, mouth. Yeah, but, you know, don't you want to, like, spit them out? Or, like, uh, or... I, I don't know how crocodiles, like, secrete like, uh, people from their mouths. They would just open it out and let them I mean, this, I mean, to be fair, this is a mech. So like, do you? The sooner you get them out of your mouth, the sooner we can go help Jay, who is stuck on the ground because we forgot about him. Right, right. I did. You you forgot about him. Though. I forgot about him. We have people in our mouth. We're trying to. Do, do you want us to engage with people in their mouth? No. Then why are you? Are, why are, why is it my fault? Let's go. Let's go get Jay. Yeah, cuz I forgot about him. <laughs> okay, um blue turn. Um what you going to do? So, my mech's powered down, right? What would you say? My mech's powered down. One one more time. Is is uh, Jay's mech powered down? Yes. Well, um oh. <laughs> 
it's not powered down. You just can't, um, like, what type of, uh, you just can't make any heavy turns with it. So you just gotta be clever. What's, um, how are you gonna rip? How will you, um, how will you, um, take action, react, um, and take temporary cover, uh, display precise fighting technique, try to pinpoint the adversary's weakness, or, um, point out the obvious to others, um, or ruin something perfectly, fail to react effectively, become demoralized by a setback, construct something dangerous, um, yeah, those are your options right now. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Jay, what do we got to do? Um, I guess, uh, fail to react to it becoming demoralized. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Cool. Give, uh, earn a point. <laughs> well, okay. Oh great, my friends aren't gonna save me. <laughs> I'm stuck in the ground. I've got a five-headed Hydra approaching me, and Ty and Maru just fucked right off. <laughs> well, good thing you think that right now because now Jay, I do want to remind you for like this next little bit here. Last game, you did earn a mech upgrade. That's right. Did we cover what that was. No, no, we didn't. We just know we that you. It. I get to decide what it is this episode. Okay. But I just want to put that in your head. All right. Um. So the new scene starts. Um. Maru, uh, is it Jay lies there, accepting the inevitable. <laughs> well, at least the people are safe, but I'm gone. Um. But then, the um shadow. Uh. Was it a Nile crocodile shadow wing mode? Um. Blocks the hit. While even though it takes the damage, it protects um their comrade. So, red turn. Hey, buddy, you're safe. How you doing? How you doing down there in that ditch? Blue turn. You know what? I'm doing. I'm doing pretty well right now. Um, couldn't complain. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. A lot worse. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I have goop. We have goop on Mario and I, but you're definitely grounded. You're well grounded. I'm happy that you're you're in a place to where you're good. Um uh, a positive yeah. is I I destroyed the very disappointing monster that ended up fighting. <laughs> yeah, you know, like that whale gorilla. Like I mean it's it's like it's you whaled on it, that's good. Pink yeah. turn. Alright. Okay. Uh Ty and our, Ty and our combined our robots. Think you can join? Think you think you can join us? All right. So, um, Maru's asking, do you guys want to commit the group action of combining your mats? Gets you out of the ground, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Everybody gains a point. Group action. Um, All right. Okay. So, um, the Nile crocodile splits into four pieces the um, massive monster restructure its um, restructures its posture from a um, knuckle walking one to that of an upright one its um, feet retract into its knees and its um, arms retract into its shoulders the um, bottom the top halves that are now split into two of the Nile crocodile combine into the shins of the um, massive monster creating full legs the um, arms that um, the um, other halves, the bottom halves of the Nile crocodile, the legs and back half, that connects into um, the shoulders of the massive monster, creating arms. The mega bat connects into the back, creating um, a winged flight pack, and um, parts of its chest slot over the chest of the massive monster, creating a unified chest piece, um, a feet of chest armor, and the head of the mega bat slots over the. Um, massive monster's face the mouth opens voltron style revealing a um a um a really badass sneering robot face um <laughs> the shadow titan is built kenzan all right guys how are you gonna handle it <laughs> red turn jay i think this is a big brain move right now 
with our big brain, do we have anything to tackle this goopy five-headed snail? Blue turn. Hold it. Is it snail monster? I th I heard I heard snail. It was slimy. Yeah, like a multi-headed snail. With dragon head. Huh. Um. Okay. What do I have? That um. You okay? Um. Tell you what. Just to, to move this forward, just so it could be fun. Um. You remember Johan gave you that um. You remember Johan gave you that um special button um <laughs> from like um in case something bad happened with uh Samantha. Right. Okay. Press. Do you want to press that button? I want to push the button. Okay, you press the button. Big button. Big button time. Pink turn. Yeah. All right. Uh, ooh, what, what is? Uh, you got something new there, Jay? All right, cool. Um, everyone, uh, I'm gonna count that as um, uh, Ty, um, Ty and Jay confide. Uh, no, Ty and Maru um, confide in Jay. Uh, Maru gains a point for confiding in someone. Um, <laughs> no, 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 other way around. Someone has to confide. In Jay. Uh, yeah, no, you confide in someone, you gain a point. Um. Okay, uh, <clears throat> um, Jay presses the, um, special button that he was given by, um, that he was, um, secretly given by, uh, Johan in case of, uh, said emergency, and some um, two portals open by the shoulders of the Shadow Titans, and, th and um, two Gremlin-style mechs. Um, pop out and land on the shoulder. One is red with a bunch of pluses on it, and the other is negative um, is blue with a bunch of uh, minuses on it. They are the Gremlin Brothers. Hmm. So, um, would you uh, so like um, so you have an op so like um, the Gremlin Brothers are here distance would you like to combine with them or order them to do something else wait combine Ooh. Yeah, they're back, dude. oh god I... oh okay because like for some dumb reason i had an idea to where like they could have actually taken the two swords that maru had but that's that's up to uh jay hey jay you got you got two you got two boy you got twins congratulations you're dead Yeah, blue turn. What you want to do with them? Uh, combine. Okay, cool. Um, pink turn. What's up? Well, that's nifty. Two two smaller robots uh, on their side. Yeah. <laughs> All right, cool. Um, those are just uh, regular turns. We're combining um, then. You and a um, hard turn for um. So yeah, take a point away from Jay because um, he is initi he initiated the combined sequence. Um, cool. The um, uh, Gremlin positive connects to the right fist of uh, the Shadow Titan, and um, Gremlin negative connects to the um, left fist of uh, the Shadow Titan, giving the Shadow Titan magnetized electrified boxing gloves. Okay. All right. Yes. Ooh, so rocky. The shadow titan pulls itself um, into a bouncing position. Um, electrical, ch um, electrical currents um, coming off the gloves as it um, moves its uh, as it uh, moves its dukes. <laughs> it's funny because right now I'm actually doing what you're describing. <laughs> yeah. On on like the on the camera. <laughs> Now you want to act. Ooh. Red turn. Jay, I like your new toys. Do we want to do the one, two on the three, four? <laughs> um. Blue turn. Yeah, we'll do the, the one, two, rumble and turn with the singles. Um. <laughs> 
hit them until they don't get up no more. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> All right, pink turn. Right, sounds like a plan. Two, two, uh, two mini robots. Two, two swords. Wait, what? Uh, two wigs. All right, so you guys want to commit? Um, so you want to commit a group action for an ultimate attack? That'll just instantly delete this guy. Yep. Okay, ultimate attack it oh, is. Um, is that a? Is that, does that change any points? Um, no, it's it, yeah, it's it's um, uh, it's, yeah, um, gain a point because um, it's a group turn. So you so you're full, and then um, Jay gets a <laughs> point, and Ty gets a point. <laughs> okay. Sounds All good. Right. So um. <laughs> All right, so the shadow, uh, so the shadow titan um, uh, delivers um, one, uh, um, one powerful punch to uh, Hydradora, then it delivers another, then it delivers three, then it delivers six, then it delivers twelve. Is that the aura aura? Then it delivers, um, <laughs> then it delivers uh, pr pretty much multiple, um, exceeding multiples of threes. Um, delivering of punches um, at Hydradora until it is pretty much nothing but dragon um, slimy dragon snail goop all over the um, all over um, Bell Hill um, the, the small uh, the small filling town of Bell Hill. Um, <laughs> what do we on call a it? On level, each individual piece explodes, um, creating kind of like a um, you're creating like kind of like fireworks. The um, Shadow Titan turns to a camera that's not there. It lifts its fist, uh, one of its uh, its right fist high in the air, and out of nowhere, there's a ding, 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 ding. Knockout. <laughs> K.O. <laughs> All right, moving uh, moving time forward. Um, everybody is unmorphed, and um, oh fuck it, no no, so I'm, I'm a, delete that description. Everybody is still in costume, but they are searching the remains of uh, the blown up Bella Theater. Right. Right. Um, Johan, it's needless to say, Johan is not there, and neither is the containment box. Right. That previously had her. Alright. Um. So, red turn. <laughs> Johan! Yoo-hoo! Are we playing peekaboo again? Where are you? Blue turn. Um, real quick, are the hostages that we uh, saved from the Dragon Hydra um, still are they there? Okay? Are they they safe? just fucked off and went home. Okay. Yeah. Right. They, they might have um, like stopped and went, "Thank you, monster freaks." That that, that might have been the only interaction. Okay. Yeah. Um. I'm going through uh, searching the remains of the Bella Theater, kind of doing inventory on the side. <laughs> <laughs> like, of course you would. Order anything more? <laughs> yeah, seeing if anything else besides the box is missing. Yeah. All right. Um, pink turn. I know. I got this. Uh, I I search. Uh, I I scan the room with the magic. Oh, okay, if that was if I possible that already. Okay, then um, remove two points, one for uh, one to summon the weapon and uh, two to and another to use it. Okay. Cool. Um, that's good. That's 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 big brain. That's a big brain move. Right. Big PP. Um. The um the onk uh the flaming onk activates the burning green energy um um causes it to levitate in the air. It then begins to spin, um creating a holographic display of what happened. Um, Johan is, um, sitting inside, um, uh, Johan is inside the theater. He's setting up the butt, um, he's setting up the relay so that you can summon the Gremlin brothers if you need help. And, um, as this happens, um, behind him, uh, behind, like, the glass doors and everything, uh, Samantha shows up in her snakeskin costume. She places her hand, um, against the door of the Bella Theater, and telekinetically rips um, the part of the building, uh, rips the building apart, creating the explosion, uh, the, um, the explosion impact that we all see. She then uh, slowly walks towards Johan. Um, Johan, um, uh, Johan turns in uses his phantom powers to turn himself invisible. 
and tries to get away. However, being a succubus, she has a keen sense of smell. Um, using her um, summoning snakes out of her body, grabs him, bites him, uh, bites him, and knocks him unconscious. She then um, um, uses the snake to draw him closer, grabbing his, um, grabbing the diminutive man by his feet, by his um, right foot, and then dragging him out of the building. Uh, the magic, uh, uh, the the flaming ankh then um, lowers back down and begins um, to return its orbit around. Um, Pink Pharaoh Maru. Red turn. Dang it. Maru, does it show uh, the direction that uh, she went? Uh, yeah, blue turn. Um. Yeah, I still do that. <laughs> All right, uh, give Jay a point. Got it. Pink turn. <laughs> uh, let, let's try it out. Let's uh, let's let's uh, let's see if I can scan the out, scan the outside. All right. Um, all right. Uh, remove a point for yourself. There you go. Um, Maru walks outside once again, casts the spell with the um, uh, flaming onk. It uh, does its trick, spins again, um, revealing another hologram of what happened. Um, she <laughs> um, she drags him to the end of uh, drags him to like a the side where the sidewalk and the street meets, um, the edge of that, and a um, por a purple electrified portal opens up. She throws him through the portal and then steps through the portal. The portal closes. The um, Ankh returns to Maru's, uh, returns to orbit Maru. Red turn. Oh, she went that way. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh, pink, turn, uh, pink turn comment, so it, pink turn's been gone. Red turn. <sighs> now what do we do? We have no way to track where she went. Jay! Do we know where her studio is? Yes, it's in town. Alright. Um. Do we need a, Do we need time to recoup, or can we just head on over there? What'd you say? Do we need time to recuperate, or do we just head on over there? Well, I'll, t I'll tell it um, from a uh, like a from a narrative standpoint. Do you want to just like end the episode with like, oh no, what's gonna happen next time? Where's Johan? Um, yeah, or do you like want to, or do you like do you want to move forward? Narrowly, that sounds like a great, like a great cliffhanger. Yeah, I think, yeah the cliffhanger. Okay, cool. Like yeah, no. Well, uh, all right. Um, all right, cool. We will end the game there. Where, um, where Johan? Where Johan? Everybody. That's um how we're gonna begin uh, that's how we're gonna start the next game um all right well thank you all for um coming out and um having fun with our game of henshin um tyler uh dude thank you so much for um using your massive apparatus to live stream this and let other people see it um before we truly wrap things up uh part of henshin is the um via is um uh, the vip round um, in which all of us, I'll even like even the chat can get involved this time, on uh, who we thought was the um, best character, who we thought um, played the best in this game. You can't vote for yourself. You can only vote for um, someone playing. Um, narrator also can't be picked. So, but I can vote for someone. I just can't vote for. I can't vote like no one can say narrator was best character, <laughs> but I can vote for people. So it's kind of like that. So I'm like a tiebreaker in case there's like everybody was like, oh no, we all like this or something. I don't know. Um, so, I see. so we're having more than, so we're having more than four picks. <laughs> but, uh, no, yeah, so like, if, so I guess narrator would be um. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I mean, uh, I mean, we have gonna have more than four votes. Yeah, so, so it'd be like that? chat and narrator. I guess would be the um, the other would be the five votes. Okay. So, Let's yeah. see. Um, but hopefully they're still uh, watching. With, uh, of course, with uh, Ty Tyler, um, who do you thought was the um, who do you thought played the best this um go around? I. I would actually have to say, let's see. Uh, 
I would have to say Jay because like I I'll admit I made the mistake of like excluding him. However, I we ex- I I excluded him despite the fact that we had civilians in our mouth. But despite like that current situation, he did well on his own versus one monster. He took a hit, but he overall he actually conquered a monster by himself while I needed help, and so did uh, Maru. Okay, cool. So that's um, one point for Jay. That's one vote for Jay. Um, Jay, um, who do you think? Uh, so, uh, Jay, uh, Dex, um, who do you think? Um, who, who's the best player this go around? Um, I want to say uh, Maru uh, for racking up some points. Uh, I don't think we've gotten to a point where um, he gained a, or that we've like got, gained a point and then we didn't have a space for like a six point. So. Okay, it's a good support. Uh, Maru, um, who are you gonna vote for? I'm gonna vote for Kai. Uh, he has some great ideas of how to do things this episode. I appreciate it. <laughs> Alright, cool, creative decision. Two binions uh, with swords, you know. <laughs> Alright, uh, tell you what, chat, um, I see what, I see your chat thinks. Chat, who do you think, um, who do you guys like, um, just like, who do you think, um, who do you like the most? Uh, let's give it a minute, um, let's give it, let's, let's give the person a minute to respond if he's actually still here. Um, but yeah, I really like to, to comment about the episode, I really did like how um, I'll admit, I set myself, I set myself up for the like the whole like three v three, because I thought we were gonna. Re- I do enjoy that he actually changed the script for the fact that. Uh, are, am I okay to talk about how we recorded the last session? Oh yeah, the old recording. Sure, go ahead, trash it. <laughs> no, no, not, no, no, not trashing it. I loved it because during the last, during the old recording that we never got a chance to publish, uh, we fought against. Um, uh, Samantha, and then yeah. we saw a glimpse of what um, Johan was. So it almost looked like he was about to die, and then he was about to pass on his powers. Uh, we were going to look for a successor because if he used his powers again, he was going to be dead, dead. That's what that's what I felt like from the last recording. So I really, it's really cool to where we went from fighting the boss as a mid boss, and then now we're fighting three monsters. But when we were distracted. Johan was by himself while trying to supply us with the new mech, like usual. Yeah. Like, what you? What did you guys think about the previous recording compared to this one? I love. I love that one more for. Uh, um. I learned. Uh, I learned the importance of impro- improvising, then. Yeah, I'm gonna say, like, you were, um, like, normally you kind of just, like, you were, um, very much, like, more on the ball with your reactions, maybe being live, spooked you, and to be like, oh, no, I gotta react now, as opposed <laughs> to, like, I gotta think of something. Yeah. Yeah. Dex, what do you think? Um, I very much enjoyed this session. Um, uh, uh, I, I also, like, that, um, that uh, we didn't fight Samantha like right away. Yeah. Like I do admit that the last recording it showed how our hubris like bit us in the ass. And but this time around we were we are our hubris is bit in a way to where we weren't prepared for Johan to be attacked unprotected. Because we all are aware that he can't use his powers accordingly. Like not the way that we could. So the fact that it's putting stress on us in two, both times, Zeke has written the script to where the pressure is on us, and I love it. Yeah, and, and this, this, this one just hit harder, so... Now we're without a mentor, now we're without backup, so it's either we have to go through his scripts and pr- through uh, the blueprints of Johan and probably fail at recreate whatever he had, or it's a matter of just like, as a situation where, oh, we find him, but he's being siphoned off, 
and I don't know what I don't know what Zeke's planning on what Samantha's doing to Johan, but if I had a big brain as a succubus, I would imagine I would suck his life force and transplant it somewhere. So it's gonna be like. Transplant? <laughs> Alright, so what's, the, well, so what's the chat have to say? What's their vote? Uh, there's no response. Okay, whatever then. Alright, my vote is um, also for Jay. Um, you, uh, like, I, like, um, you, like, um, I was kind of thinking, like, alright, man, you're by yourself. Um, no points. This is gonna be, like, real tough to get out of it. <laughs> like, you just went, uh, no, you, you, you just worked your way out of it. And, um, made up. I'm real impressed with that. Woo! Go Jay. Good, uh, good job, Dex. So yeah. So next round. So like next game. Uh, you um you start off with two points instead of uh one point. Okay. Oh, we'll, have to we'll have to remember that. Yeah, it's okay. We'll remember when we start. Uh, we'll remember when we start le next time. Um. So yeah. Thank you everybody for um letting us uh come on the old live stream. Um. My name is uh, Zeke Fowler. I run uh, Cosmic Rejects on YouTube. Um, every once in a while, uh, I'm gonna start live streaming uh, Pokemon Shield, um, like um, d um, doing some uh, raids and uh, some doing some Gigantamax raids. Um, I also um, review Tokusatsu, and um, I'm a big fan of it, um, which is why I wanted to do a um, RPG podcast where we play as Power Rangers. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. That's awesome. Uh, you guys got anything? Uh, uh, Dex? Dex? Uh, Coda? Um, I've got nothing to promote. Um, I've just been playing this game with my buddy. Uh, enjoying uh, quarantine for the most <laughs> part. Uh, not some more Kota here. I also have nothing much to promote. Unless, unless I upload a... Unless I draw something and upload it. Um, Artwork. Like, Oh. That'd be like I don't know if you do plan on doing it, but I, I, I would love to see like your concept art of like our mechs and everything too. I I think you oh, did a doodle. Dude, I, I'm not that. <laughs> hey, I think you're lovely. <laughs> I know I like your art too. It's very um, it has very whimsical. Like actually, I would like to see like very whimsical versions of everything. Yeah, because like if anything else, like. Um, I would really like down the road. I would like for how for for how for however long this ride's gonna be. If you're able to make time for it, I would enjoy looking at the concept of what goes through your head. Okay. In regards to the show, I would really love that. I'd pay you if I had to. Oh, oh, I'm not, I'm not at that level yet. I, I am, uh, I am seeking that level, but uh, not, not right now. Yeah, no, 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 definitely. You're, you're definitely. Uh, see what happens. Yeah, next yeah, month. Yeah. All right, cool. All right, um, next month we will find out what happens to Johan. Uh, Woo! Bye, everybody. All right, I'll exit uh, the call too. Let's have a casual chat until then. Uh, whenever that may. <laughs> right. Let's have another casual chat sometimes until then. And as always, my name is Tyler. I'm your friend, and I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>